data miners are currently harvesting your online comments and creating profiles of you. Facebook's recent controversy and announcement of a new privacy tool might have in fact made things worse and made it even harder for you to find and delete your data. In this video, we will show you how exposed all your data is, how to protect yourself, how to delete the comments data miners are using to profile you, and at the end of the video, we will show you where to go and check if your data has been harvested and search your name to see if you've been profiled and how to remove yourself from this database. According to Facebook, approximately 400,000 websites use the Facebook comment plugin. That means hundreds of millions of comments using the real names and links to people's Facebook profiles is out there, available for data miners to harvest. This is dangerous because what you say online is being used to profile you. Companies now even search for your comments and opinions online before they hire you. To demonstrate this vulnerability, we start by posting a comment on BuzzFeed, one of the many sites that use the Facebook comment plugin. Once posted, the comment shows up on our Facebook activity log. Over the course of several years, some people find themselves posting hundreds of comments across many sites, and oftentimes, they wish to delete some or all of those comments. With Facebook's activity log, you can see the comment. Naturally, your urge is to hit delete and think these comments are deleted. In fact, they're only deleted from your activity and will remain online for data harvesters and you won't even know it's out there. As you can see, the comment remains on the news sites regardless if you check right away or wait a few days. In order to delete your comments, you must first go to your activity log and go to the actual article. Once there, you must find your comment and manually select to delete it on the site. Once done, return to Facebook and delete it from the activity log. Was this an innocent mistake on Facebook's part? Or is this an attempt by Facebook to make it seem like they're doing more for privacy because of all the negative media attention? Let us know your thoughts in the comments section below. If you want to continue to make comments and share your opinions online, make sure to use an anonymous browser like Tris. This new browser allows you to change your nickname as many times as you want and allows you to chat with people browsing the same site as you or search the same keywords as you, all 100% anonymous. They also have a search tool once you download it to see if your comments were harvested and it will show you how to delete your harvested comments. Thanks for watching.